Um, this is going to be the existing furnace that we have or the air handler that we have. It's got a coil underneath and then a coil box underneath. But there is no coil in it, I already checked. But there is another filter right in here that we want to get rid of. And we want to put in basically a base can with a filter rack and just one filter. Make sure it looks real nice and clean for them and that way we don't have all this stuff in the way. But that's what we're looking to do here as far as this side goes. We're also going to be running the drain lines for this heat pump. Basically go straight up if we can and out. This room right here is right by the stairs. We'll have these floor joists running through them. There also is a floor drain right directly under in the middle of the water heater where that's at. I think this would be a little bit cleaner or good either way. So whichever you guys think would be better is good as well. Um, Cause you guys will be the ones that are doing it overall, but we can come out through one of these floor joists, almost follow directly into the pre drilled holes, come directly out all the way over here, push it all the way back, go straight down. And this is the washer. So we can go to the washer drain just right over there. That would be my preferred method for this. Now for the line set side, we're going to have to basically follow those same floor joists coming out this way. There is a chimney on this side and we kind of want to go a little bit this way if we can and go directly out. Or if we need to put it over here, we can as well. Um, but I'll show you guys that we're okay uh, cutting uh, access ports that we need to and then covering them up with a vent. And then... Yeah, that's, that's roughly what we're going to be doing here for the line set, and then we'll go outside.